All right, y'all, we're gonna give this a try. <laughs> I don't know if it's gonna work. Uh, I just got some new tires on this thing, um, on my Jeep, and I thought I'd give it a real quick uh, video on here on how these things perform. As you can see, it's a nice rainy day here in Tulsa. Um, and I don't know if you can hear any of the road noise at all. This is going to be a experimental uh, video more than anything. See how uh, much uh, road noise you can hear through this video camera. And um, I'm, uh, like I said, I think the uh, main purpose here, not only a test video, but I got some new tires. And just want to do a, a quick video. I got the Goodyear Wrangler uh, MTRs. Um, they are the uh, tire with the uh, Kevlar sides. They're the, uh, I think MT is a mud tire. Uh, they've got the Kevlar sides and the uh, new. Uh, let's get you somewhere where you're not going to fall over. Of course, in Tulsa traffic, you might fall over anyway. Uh, they've got some sort of a new special uh, uh, rubber compound, from my understanding, uh, that they use in the uh, pro making the process of this tire. Um, I'll do some uh, close-ups of the uh, tire itself and take some photos. Anyway, as you can tell, for a tire that is supposed to be aggressive it is not very loud um, I mean it's a little bit louder than the stock normal tire um, and I wish I had a video of this thing before I put the um, but before I put these tires on you know comparison video of stock uh, Goodyear Wranglers and uh, and this one I'm gonna get up to speed here. And hopefully you can hear some of that. I mean, it's not loud at all. <laughs> it just has a good, uh, like it's singing to you, and that's about it. you're looking down at the hood again let me get you a little bit of windshield I mean the uh, pickup I don't know if you could hear that or not but the pickup in front of me accelerated and I could hear his exhaust over over this so get into a, a different type of a uh, concrete Right now, I'm cruising along right at 65 miles an hour. Yeah, these are not bad whatsoever. I haven't taken them off-road yet. I've not been in the mud or rock or anything else, so I can't report on how they do that way. But they are uh, on the road so far, on the road surfaces. Um, if I give it the gas, it goes. There's no tire slippage that I've seen yet. Um, of course, we're just now getting into winter, and I am itching for that first good winter snow, if we get one, and um, to go out and play a little bit. The only bad problem about the winter snow here in Tulsa is we're on a uh, on a little line that 30 miles north of us or 30 miles south of us uh, is either snowing or raining. We're just right on that line, and uh, 
thunderstorm the same way. I mean, they go either north or south of us, and very rarely do we get super hit like the uh, Oklahoma City area does. Um, but anyway, here in the Tulsa area, back to my main part of this rambling about the uh, Tulsa area and the snow, is we don't have just snow on the ground. We normally have ice on the ground and on the roadways before we get any snow on top of that. And so, uh, you know, we'll have eighth quarter half inch ice, probably not half inch, but we'll have an eighth quarter inch ice on the ground and we'll get snow on top of that, you know, from the sleet and drizzle and that type of thing. So, uh, We don't just get the good snow, first off snow, and just snow on the ground. We've got the ice, um, you know, as the uh, first layer. Either which way, you know, I'm kind of interested and I'm ready to go play, uh, have some fun. Here in a minute, I'm going to turn into a, a parking lot that is an asphalt parking lot. And you'll hear a difference in the tire sound going from concrete to asphalt. And we're just driving up the road here. We've got to go to a meeting. In fact, I'll probably turn those windshield wipers off. It's just barely foggy now. We had a good fog this morning on the way into work. How about some acceleration? <laughs> I'll probably have to cut that out. I need to find a good mount to put in here to hold that camera so it doesn't keep falling backwards like that. this other into this lot on the asphalt and of course I'm not going to be able to get up to speed but you can, if you could hear that slowing down it sounds different you almost hear the knobbies better on the on the asphalt, you know, slowing down. Back on concrete. You just don't hear that knobby sound quite as well. Here we are. I don't know if that's a review worth anything or not. But anyway, uh, y'all have a good day and everything. And uh, have a good one.